Hey everyone, and welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be discussing the Heartland cast's real age and their life partners. Heartland is a famous Canadian TV series that aired for the first time in 2007, so it must be one of the longest TV shows in North America. And with that fact in mind, we do see some of the actors did grow up with the show. So what are the actors' actual ages now, and which cast members are in a relationship? In the first place, we have Amber Marshall. Amber Marshall, who plays the role of the main character in the show, Amy, inherits her mother's ability to to be able to intuit the needs of horses and practice natural horsemanship. Today, she's 33 years old, but at the beginning of the show, Amy was only a 15-year-old girl who got injured in a car crash that killed her mother. However, back then, Amber Marshall was 19 years old. When she first got on the show, Amber's character starts off a romantic relationship with a man named Ty Borden. Ty joined the ranch when he was invited by Marion to come to become a ranch hand at Heartland. This was as part of his probation. Despite having a bumpy relationship and being uncertain, they grew to love each other deeply, and around the season, they got married. After six years on the show, Amber got married to Sean Turner, a photographer, on July 27, 2013, after they got engaged in spring of 2012. Interestingly enough, Amber got engaged around the same time as her character in the show. Next, we have Michelle Morgan as Samantha Louise. Samantha Louise, also known as Lou Fleming Morris, returned home at the beginning of the series to help run the Heartland. Today, she's 39 years old, but at the beginning of the show, Morgan was 26 years old, almost around the same age as her character. Since she's supposed to be around 11 years older than Amy, she plays the role perfectly. While her on-screen persona may be married to Peter, in real life, Morgan is married to Derek Tisdale. Next, we have Sean Johnston playing Jack Barrett. The oldest main character in Heartland, Jack is Louie and Lou's grandfather and was Marion's father. Playing the role of an old man, Sean is way much younger than Jack. He started playing the character when he was just 49 years old, and today he is 63, and his performance is still as spectacular as ever. Sean's married to his wife, Sue Johnston, whom he posts pictures of her on Instagram a lot. Alicia Newton is the actress in charge of the role of Georgina, also known as Georgie Fleming Morris. Georgina, a child adopted by Lou, Georgie is Lou and Peter's adopted daughter, Jack's adopted great-granddaughter, and Phoenix is owner. In her first appearance in the show, she was orphaned when she was only three after a drunk driver killed her father. She was separated from her brother Jeff, and she started to develop a lot of behavioral problems when she first arrived at the ranch. She was known for misbehaving a lot and even ran away once. However, since she loves the ranch and wanted to stay, she did her best to improve her behavior and get along with the others. Alicia Newton was around 12 years old when she started acting in the series as Georgie. Her talent at the time shone through, and today she's 20 years old and has been around for seven seasons. Since Alicia Newton is just around 20 years old, she isn't married yet. Next, we have Chris Potter playing the role of Tim Fleming. Tim Fleming is a character who returns to his family after years of abandoning them due to his issues with alcohol. He is Lou and Amy's father, and he left his family when the girls were still really young. With Amy being only four at the time and Lou being around 14 years old. When their mother dies, he decides to move back in and purchase his big ranch river, making him practically a neighbor in Heartland. At the beginning of the show, Chris was 47 years old, which is just around the age of Tim Fleming since he had a 25-year-old daughter. Right now, Chris is 61 years old and is happily married to Karen Potter, and they have four kids together. Don't go anywhere, because now that we're done with the ages and life partners of the main characters of the show, we'll be moving on to the supporting cast, so stick around. Up next, we have Carrie James playing Caleb O'Dell's role. Caleb O'Dell is a ranch hand hired by Jack after Ty leaves for four months. When he first comes on the show, he shows that he has feelings for Amy, which locks him up in a heated rivalry with Ty over Amy's love, and he even gets to date her for a while. However, Amy returns to Ty eventually, and Caleb moves on from the heartbreak and starts going out with Ashley Stanton. This time, he succeeded in being in a relationship with Ashley, and he marries her. As of real life, Carrie was born on August 2nd, 1986, which makes him around 34 years as of today. At the moment, Carrie James is not officially married, however, However, he is in a relationship with actress Barley James. And then we have Gabriel Hogan or Peter Walter Morris in the series. Peter Walter Morris, Lou's ex-husband, was first introduced at the beginning of the show and was referred to as PW, which are his initials. He was the owner of a small company called Bedford Oil and was caught doing some drilling on the Heartland property. This, of course, caused countless problems and enraged everyone and made Lou organize a protest against his company for disturbing their peace. Interestingly, around this time, Lou started to grow closer to him and started showing friendly feelings toward him. But after an exciting courtship, Peter eventually marries Lou, and sadly, they divorce a few years later. Gabriel Hogan was born on May 17, 1973, making him 48 as of this video. He is married to actress Inga Cadronel and has one kid. Then we have Nathaniel Arcand as Scott Cardinal. Cardinal is a good native Canadian friend of the Bartlett Fleming household and is also Heartland's main vet. Cardinal had a pretty tough childhood, but was able to turn out well thanks to Marion's help in the first two seasons. Cardinal had a romantic relationship with Lou, but sadly, they broke up.
breakup in the second season. While Lou was pretty upset about the breakup, Cardinal didn't look extremely phased about it. However, he eventually regretted the loss of their relationship and the fact that he didn't try harder to get back together with Lou. Unfortunately, by the time he regrets his lack of effort, Lou is already in a committed relationship with Peter. Nathaniel was born on November 13, 1971, and is currently 49 years old with four kids. He's married to his long-term partner, Jolene, whom he married in 2016. Next, we have Jessica Steen as Lisa Stillman in the show. Lisa Stillman is the charismatic owner of Fairfield Stables and a well-known horse breeder. She's first introduced when she meets Amy for some advice regarding her horses. And in the same period, we see that there might be a budding relationship between her and Jack. A few episodes later, they started dating, but sadly, it's difficult for them to make the relationship work because of Lisa's work, since she's always in the south of France seasonally for work, and that puts a strain on their relationship. However, the couple eventually gets back together and decides to elope. They decide to live in different houses even after eloping. By the time the series reaches season 11, we find out that Lisa's business is in huge trouble, and she's trying to hide the fact from Jack, but eventually he finds out and convinces her to live with him at the Heartlands, which she agrees to. Jessica is around 55 years old, born on December 19, 1965. Interestingly, she's never been married. At one point, there were rumors that she was married to her friend David Newsom. However, we haven't been able to find any proof of the information, but she's single for the moment. And at last but not least, we got one of our beloved yet tragic characters, Ty Borden. Played by Graham Wardle, Ty Borden was just a child who was badly abused by his stepfather. At the beginning of his appearance, he seems a bit older when he found the courage to fight his abusive stepdad after seeing his mother getting attacked by him. Unfortunately, this resulted in Ty getting arrested and sent to juvenile hall, but he was released a while later. Then Marion asked him to come and work for her at Heartland. The young man later falls in love with Amy and goes on to marry. They live a happy life for a while before he sadly passes away. Graham Wardle was born on September 6, 1986 and is around 34 years old. He was 21 years old when he was asked to play Ty, a kid of around 16. He's known for being Amy's husband in the series, but in real life, he married Allison Wardle in 2015 and divorced her just three years later. And as far as we know, he is still not in a committed relationship, at least not yet. That's all we have for today. Thanks so much for watching. Which one of these celebrities' ages came off as unexpected? Were you shocked to learn about some spouses? Let us know in the comments down below.